Happy, Happy Father's, Father's Day. Day! Thank you, family. Happy to be here with Happy you. Happy Father's Day, Daddy. Thank you. Thank you, Jenna. And Happy Father's Day to everybody. Happy Father's Day. To all the dads. We're at Montauk in Suffolk County. Long Island is divided into two counties, Nassau County, which is on the west, and Suffolk County, which is on the east. And so we're at the tip, the very east point of New York. You can't go any further east. So here we are today, we're gonna to check out the lighthouse, we're gonna check out the water and this is the coast, but we made a great drive on this beautiful day. It's still early, it's about, well, 11. Here we are, Montauk Point State Park. Mm. Okay, we're in the lower parking lot. We're gonna walk up to the main area and right up to the lighthouse. On the lower parking lot, they have cones. Every other spot is marked, marked out for social distancing, but not here. Here we go, it's the Montauk Lighthouse. Last time we came here, the lighthouse wasn't open for tours. It's open today. We're not gonna do it. I think we'll wait till all the social distancing, whatever is done, but we just came here to take pictures of the lighthouse on this gorgeous day and then walk down to the water and check out the beach again and then uh, hopefully we get some drone footage. This is our second time to the lighthouse and we're all going to walk down by the water. Last time I think just um, my husband daddy went with Maui and this time we're all going to go for Father's Day. The lighthouse behind us was approved by the second congress under President George Washington, the first president, in 1792. It was built and finished in 1796. It's been here for a very long time. It's the first lighthouse in the state of New York and the fourth largest in the United States. But it um, has sandstone blocks that have come from Connecticut and the light flashes every five seconds and you can see it from a distance of 19 nautical miles. So here we go, we went to the bottom now, we went to the ocean where the land meets the sea. So we, we were blessed enough to go to the end of Highway 1 down in Florida in the Keys and now we're at the end of Highway 27, but the end of Highway 1 up north is somewhere in Maine, I think. It's such a beautiful place, Montauk. So New York has surprised us quite a bit. It's beautiful in Suffolk County. It's very green, it's very lush, and like I said, the water here is uh, it's just gorgeous. Being from Hawaii, it's hard because the standard is so high, but you can't really expect Hawaii everywhere you go, but this has definitely surprised us as far as how beautiful it is out here and how uh, fresh the air is. There's a lot of people out today, so we're just trying to take some pictures over here and then go somewhere else where there's less people, less crowds, people getting your pictures and all that. We've been kind of holed up in the house just like everybody else, but today feels so good. There's a nice cool breeze blowing through here. It's about 75 degrees, maybe almost 80, but it doesn't feel so hot over here because it's already getting humid. But hopefully you guys are having a good weekend and we took a little break uh, because I think we needed to take a break just like everyone should take a break. It seems like hopefully everybody's doing good, but we are here in Montauk, New York, the end of the world, the farthest east you can go in the state of New York, right on the water. Right here is the Atlantic Ocean, right, up, right behind us, it's the Atlantic Ocean. But you can't go any further than this. There's fishing, surfing, no surf today. But we love coming out here to Montauk. We've been blessed to live in uh, a few places in the United States. New York is our last, we're in Florida before this. We miss Florida uh, quite a bit. We have friends and um, some family there, so it has good memories. We are in Utah, Virginia before that. Each place has its own nice areas. Uh, but we, I noticed one thing, no matter where you go, people complain about the weather, the traffic. Um, and if you stay there most of your life in, in a certain region, 
everybody thinks it's the same way. So everywhere I go, they joke about the weather being crazy, changing from day to day. We kind of find out that every region and every state we live in, it's the same thing. So everyone across the country is really complaining about the same things. It's pretty funny, but we have enjoyed our time here in New York. We've been here over a year, but we definitely have a lot of memories here, just like Florida. Our kids are a little bit older, so everyone in the family has a lot more memories here. But this is one of our favorite places to come here. It's really good to be out. We're just loving it. The nice weather. We're just so used to going on road trips. And even though if it's just for a day, it's so nice. The water. Shayna and Maui gets to play and throw rocks. And yeah, we're not inside walls. It's just, it's refreshing. Really refreshing. Alright, so we came out a little bit later than I like to. It took two hours to get here. We got up at five this morning, made some musubis, made some fruits, cut some fruits, made, made lunch to bring with us. So that's a good thing. We don't want to stop anywhere and just want to... We got used to making our own food. We like it. But if we can come next time again, we're going to leave real early. If I leave the house to get here at six before the crowds... These are the tumbled rocks. They're, that means they're tumbled in water and then they kind of turn clear. If they're tumbled enough, then they could be like glass. Very nice. But this one's just a little bit tumbled. Alright, so from the lighthouse, it's a quick left turn. There's a little trail that goes right down to the water. It's a good, I don't know, 200 meter walk. So not too far. We're gonna go up on the other side. I think there's less people down there. We can still do the same thing we're doing, not worry about so many people around us. Um, yeah, COVID, one thing, but really, we take pictures, it's nice to have nobody around. So we're gonna go do that now, go up to the other side. Here's another view of the lighthouse, walking up this trail from the ocean right here in Montauk. It doesn't get any better than this. Look at this behind us. Well, I'm sure it could get better, but it can't get any worse. We're having a great time. So there's water behind us, the lighthouse behind us here is a little path we're gonna walk down to the other side so we can hopefully see an area or go to an area where there's less people. It's starting to get a lot more crowded now. It's about lunchtime, so people are awake. This is not on your bucket list, it should be. This is the end of Long Island, Montauk, New York. I guess there was a Netflix show about Montauk. But it's really a nice community. We just passed the Hamptons. Hamptons is where all the rich and famous live. It's very nice, very nice area. Now this is this is a wonderful place to be. Like we're so blessed to be out this way to see everything there is to see that we've seen in our lives so far, and um, being here as a family. That's the most important thing to me on Father's Day. So we went down a path and found a shortcut away from the crowd in the middle of these bushes. And found a little area that we can go to, but there's nobody else around. So we're waiting for these people to come up, and we're gonna go down there and do our thing. We get like a private view and space. All right, so we found a good spot. It got pretty crowded here, but look, now there's less people, maybe because it's lunchtime. I don't know, but I threw the drone up there pretty quickly. I haven't flown it in about a month, so I didn't realize the battery's about 50%. It didn't last very long, so I got a couple of drone shots. I hope you enjoyed that. We're gonna definitely come back earlier next time and get better footage and just in a more calm environment with less people. So here we go, we're gonna back up to the car and go eat some lunch. Hi, this is Maui and I'm gonna 
show you rock my the rock balancing. So this is mine I made right there. I'll show you. Right here. <clears throat> I'll show you my second one I made. Um, I think that's my second one. Yeah, this is my second one I made. And it's pretty cool. Now I'm going to show you the huge rock. The, the gigantic one. First, let me sh show you the other ones. And then I'll show you the gigantic rock. This one kind of looks like a bunny. <clears throat> that one over there kind of looks like a robot. And this is where I thought they had camping area here. See, kind of looks like they camped here. Yeah. So, here's the big rock. As you can see, it's bigger than anyone you've seen so far. See? And there's ticks in here, inside this area too. Ticks! And we're going through the shortcut, and ticks everywhere. That's where I want to go, really fast. So, that is it. And I'll bring you right back. And see, I have slippers on. See? Slippers. Let's go. We're driving back through town. We're here in Montauk Main Street. And you can see how busy it is with cars, people. But summer has begun and people are back out, tired of this lockdown. Look at this. It's so exciting to see all the boutiques open, though we're not going in them yet. We'll come back and then we'll probably go in them then. But all of these stores here are open. The restaurants, they have really cute boutiques here. But look at all the stores that are open and have a lot of customers just hanging out. It is fun in Montauk. We had a great time today. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and coming along with us on our wonderful adventure and we had such a great day and we hope you'll keep watching our videos. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and hit the notification bell. We're in Montauk and we're out.